reservoir is subject to, to suction from the motor, so it already compresses, so you have to pump over that. <laughs> it's having to do like tipping backwards trying to pump it. But I gotta connect the pump because that's the only way you can get true volume swells. I can't do true volume. Well, there is oh, so a human performer can get right. volume changes. You pump harder because that governor that's time, that keeps the tempo going. So if there's more air, being, uh, more suction, then it's just gonna be a stronger signal. The pneumatic gonna collapse faster and punch the hammer harder. Also, a common misconception is that the a lot of people think the um, player unit plays the keys themselves. Hey, how are you doing? Good, good. How's it yeah. going? Can I come in? Yeah, of course. Oh. Yeah. A lot of people think the the, the man the down, plays the keys themselves, and um, sit down. I can't see. Oh, gotcha. But the uh, but it actually instead of playing the keys, it actually strikes the um, the whippings or, or the repetitions, and then the keys fall on their own weight. Once the action is so, it, the the actual machine does not ever touch the keys or the mechanism. The the earliest ones would actually be, you could push up. They were on wheels, and they would actually they would actually play the keys like fingers, and they would push you push them up to the piano, and they would actually take over and play. So if I could find one of those, that would be really cool. There is. Let's see. You see, have a quiet button does work. It just basically put, <laughs> it, there's a, it puts a leak in the system somewhere, so you can hear the air. You got fast, fast forward. <laughs> I don't like this part. That's super quiet. It's like a cutout. What do you think? Should we get one more, maybe? Sure. <laughs> 